Hi everybody, welcome to Simply Scuba. Here we've got the big blue TL3800P dive torch. So this is a relatively small but pretty powerful dive torch. This has 3,800 lumens of light and that focuses it into a tight spotlight beam so it can really pierce through the water. Uh, it's that good all arounder. You can sort of illuminate stuff around it as well but most of the light is just focused into that tight 10 degree spotlight beam. Uh, let's take a closer look. So this is how it arrives uh, in a, a little dry bag, which is quite nice. This is like a, I don't know, I'm not good at judging volumes, like a five litre dry bag, which is kind of cool. It's that tough like PVC tarpaulin material, uh, so strong and reliable. Traditional roll top, you've got the little attachment points. Uh, you've got a little card with specs on the, uh, on the torch. Uh, the maximum 38,000, uh, sorry, 3,800, so 3,800 lumens. Um, lithium ion rechargeable battery pack, 32,650 battery, uh, 10 degree narrow beam, just more information about burn times and all that kind of stuff. Um, on the back, you actually have a separate D ring. So I imagine if you sort of create some kind of strap, you can use this for uh, for whatever, really, keeping this stuff dry. Oh, it actually comes with a strap, so that's quite nice. Um, so yeah, you can use the dry bag and repurpose it for whatever, keeping your stuff dry or the wet stuff contained. On the inside, you get a cardboard box, which on the inside, You have the torch itself. We'll take a closer look at that in a second. Uh, you get a little book uh, instruction manual just going on how to recharge the battery and all that stuff. Uh, cardboard insert, which is hiding a lot of interesting stuff. Okay, so we have a battery recharger with a UK three pin uh, USB plug um, to plug that in and a wrist lanyard inside of that as well. This is a USB type C charger um, to, uh, to recharge the battery. That is the beast of a battery. Um, so that's going to hold a, a decent amount of burn time uh, despite that, what, 3,800 lumens. Little section of, uh, of silicone grease just to grease the O-rings. Don't use too much because it's going to attract um, sort of dust and hair and stuff. But a little pot of silicone grease is always useful. A lantern style grip. Um, I'll show you how to attach that in a second. And a fabric Goodman style grip and a pair of um, sort of replacement gaskets. Uh, or are they O-rings? They could be O-rings. Um, so yeah, that's a, a sort of something that can fit to the back of your hand so you can still use your hands uh, instead of using that lantern style grip or just holding it as a good old fashioned torch. Um, but yeah, let me um, sort of charge that battery up and show you what it can do. Okay, so I've attached the uh, the handle, uh, the uh, the lantern grip. There's this little mounting point down at the uh, sort of the head of the torch that just allows it to lock in place, and then you use a bolt to screw it down so it's strong and secure. This is actually made out of metal, uh, so really strong and secure. You've got this ergonomic grip, so you can grab onto it and use it as a uh, lantern. You also have a uh, another attachment point for the lanyard, so you can attach it onto that. Um, I'm just going to pop this off real quick because uh, I didn't actually bolt it on. Um, and then we can take a closer look at just the torch if you're using it as a hand torch. So three LEDs in the front, that's what's producing all of that light. Add big, big head on this, but relatively short body. Now that we have these rechargeable lithium ion batteries, torches can be more powerful, but more compact at the same time. Anodized aluminium body, so it's still pretty light. There's a decent amount of weight to it, uh, but it's by far not heavy or not a heavy torch. Most of the weight is in the uh, in the head and the the push button activation, very easy to use. You've got a, a little section of plastic around the side. That's a color coded battery level indicator. So as that changes color, it lets you know how your battery is doing. And, uh, and then the main section of the body, you've got this uh, sort of cross hatching to give you a bit of grip. And right down at the bottom of the torch, you have two attachment points for a lanyard so you can keep it strong and, uh, and secure on you. 
Activating the torch, very quick and easy. Every time you push the button, it's gonna cycle through the different power settings. So if I just switch it on, you can see, so this is full power and then press it again and it dials it down and then down and then down and then eventually off. Uh, if it's on for any length of time and you press the button as you saw at the start, uh, it just switches it off. And if you hold it down, it goes into an SOS mode. I'm not gonna do that for you. Um, if you uh, sort of have photosensitive epilepsy. Um, but yeah, as you can see, this is the beam angle, pretty tight spotlight beam angle, but there's also a corona as well. So for lighting things up and signaling in the water, it's, uh, it's pretty good. And yeah, 3,800 lumens is gonna pierce through the water very, very efficiently. Um, and yeah, decent burn times from that really big rechargeable battery. And because you can recharge it from a, um, a three pin uh, USB plug, it's, um, yeah, you can recharge that almost anywhere where you can recharge, you can use the same charger as your smartphone and all that kind of stuff. Just plug in that cradle and, uh, and you're good to go. Getting into the torch is very easy. Uh, you just unscrew the body from it. It has a double O-ring seal. So these, <coughs> you can just see down here, light amount of grease and you have those two spare ones as well so if these two start to uh, to wear out you can swap them out and uh, and then there's the battery on the inside uh, screwing it back together uh, i always like to unscrew it until it clicks and then you know that the, uh, the threads are actually lined up and then you can screw it in just hand tight you don't have to uh, sort of go too crazy um, and there you go you're ready to go diving so who's the 3800 for? This is a, a, a quite a powerful dive torch. If you're just doing like a night dive in uh, sort of clear blue waters, using it at full power is gonna be a bit of overkill, but you can dial it down and use one of the lower settings and that extends your burn time. So that'd be a good uh, sort of one charge thing. You charge it up at the beginning of like a week's liverboard and that's the only torch that you need. Uh, or if you do need a very powerful um, torch beam to be able to pierce through some murky waters, uh, then yeah, this has plenty of power because it's got that nice big rechargeable battery in it that you can top up from time to time. Uh, you're always sure that you have enough battery for the dive ahead. You've got that battery level indicator that just changes color uh, depending on how much battery is left in the torch so yeah it's a good solid well put together torch you've got a few different mounting options as well if you want to uh, sort of hold it with a lantern grip or with that goodman style handle uh, it's giving you plenty of options or just as a regular torch um yeah it's it's well constructed well put together nice finish on it um it feels very strong and reliable and yeah all the uh, the specifications there for a really powerful torch now there's going to be more information down in the uh, sort of description below if you click on the link for simplyscuba.com there's going to be more information on our website with all the different burn times and all the different power settings and all that good stuff uh just click on that link down in the description so you can buy it from us at simply scuba thank you for watching everybody and of course safe diving Thank you.